Hello everyone, Rich here, back for another From the Depths Sinking Ship video, and this is the sinking or the destruction of the SS Ile de France. Now I've already done a video of this which was basically a recreation of the final voyage, no, the last voyage, sorry, uh, the film featuring the ship. Uh, so that was sort of uh, a film recreation. This is just plain destruction, which has been requested many times. I better get back into doing these because that's what people want to see for some reason. So, uh, Ile de France here. I've already uh, done a tutorial for this thing for Minecraft, so if you want to see that, it's on my channel, SS Ile de France. And uh, yeah, that's that. So, uh, the purpose of today, like I say, is just to destroy it. So, we've got the Emma Jane aiming the guns at it, and weird colour changes from a distance. So, it goes from proper colours too washed out colours. Yes, from the depths have changed their colour palette, which makes it look shit. But anyway, enough about that. Let's get on to the sinking. So I shall stand over here and aim at the stern for fun. Oh my god, that was loud. A few holes in the stern there. And the ship takes a tumble for the stern wise. And yeah, the colour schemes do look a bit washed out. Something else just blow up. Yeah, it's uh, not a pretty look, but nonetheless, it's got the uh, stern going down now, so it's not going to take long for this thing to go down. But uh, the water effects at least still look good. I don't know if this video is going to go the full length because, uh, as for some of you know from the depths, it's very unstable and has a habit of crashing, so may not get a full video. Anyway, let's get on and uh, shoot a bit more. And any more movement? I don't think there is. Let's go and have a look. Got a big hole in the side there, which is always wonderful. And there's not a lot of movement. No, it's just the water going up and down. See a big hole down there. And uh, the other, where's the other hole? The other hole's down there. So there's lots of big holes, but slightly the wrong place. So I've got to aim a bit further forward now. So. Aim roughly about there. Oh, there we go, that's got that moving now. Now the stern goes down even more, and the bow shall now rise. In theory, anyway, so the bow's, bow's starting to rise a bit. And the stern is completely under the superstructure. The water is up to the top of the superstructure now, so lifeboats are going under. You're going down quite quick now. Kind of more horrific than the uh, the video I made earlier. It's not going to be long now. So while we're here, let's aim at one of the funnels just for fun. And that made the ship bounce a bit. What's that shell going? Off to land. Oh, didn't do much damage. Scorched it a bit. Oh, made a hole through there, but there's not much damage I would have thought. Oh, oh I know why. The uh, funnel's made out of heavy armour, that's, that's why it didn't blow up too much. The reinforced funnel, that one, so if that fell on here, it's going to do a lot of damage. Alright, so now we've got the, uh, the bow is... Was that about a 45 degree angle? Mm, nah, maybe a bit less than that. But is the water still rising, or is the ship sort of... No, she's still moving. Still gradually upending. Probably just takes so long. Then look at the damage. We've got one shell went right through the superstructure there. And we all know that... Oh, she's on the seabed now. So she ain't going to go no further, so she's stuck on the uh, sand down the bottom there. So a couple more shots and then she'll be down with the fishes. So let's aim a bit further forward. Let's try and get all four guns aimed this time. I didn't expect it to move that far backwards, but there you go. There we go. That's, I think that's enough to bring her down. And yeah, that's it. That's pretty much the end of SS Ile de France. So a pretty short video, as you can tell. It's uh, not a lot happening in this one. But uh, it's going to take a little while before she gets to the seabed. 
don't think there's many compartments in this ship for it to uh, be a problem. I know with some of my ships, they've got so many compartments, it takes forever to sink it. But uh, she's not long for the seabed. Unless she sort of plonks herself. False propeller. Unless she sort of lands at a funny angle. So the stern is rising a bit for some reason. And the bow is sort of going down. There's a lot of funny physics going on here, as you can tell. Stern's rising, bow's going down. The ship is levelling out a bit. But she's on the seabed. So, oh, I think the problem is she's on the... Oh, there, look, the propellers are on, <laughs> are on a bank there. So she ain't going to go down no further. I think she's settled there. So there's... There's sort of like a harbour sinking, really. You've got a ship which is sort of in the water. And the mast are just sticking out the top. Which is more of a hazard now to shipping than anything anything else. So, yeah, I'm going to put some... Uh, Marker boys there, just as <laughs> a sort of a, a danger to shipping. Oh, anyway, she's on the seabed. You can see her from there, but from down here you cannot. So that's what matters the most. And, uh, yeah, it just looks weird. No, she's on the seabed. She ain't gonna go no further. A piece has fallen out, which uh, is always good. Oh, pieces are still falling out. She's starting to break up a bit. So some of the not attached pieces are detaching. Put a shell plating on there. Anything else around the bow in the back? Gone. Uh, the rudder's gone. That's always a good thing. Oh, there it is. <laughs> That's what's left of the rudder. And uh, yeah, it's pretty hollow in there. And uh, yeah, there's not a lot. Uh, not a lot going on. I think if this was real life, the ship probably would have bent around these mounds. But of course, this ain't real life. So, oh well, never mind. Anyway, that is the uh, sinking of the SS Ile de France. She's sunk, even though she's still visible. And uh, we'll call it a day there. So, um, yeah, I'll leave it at that. So this is Rich signing off, logging off, disappearing. And I shall return with another video soon. So, um, bye for now.